Now, a lot of people love those warm February temperatures in the 70s today, but we're in for a change, of course. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> How about two cold fronts in the next three days? How about no? <laughs> <laughs> well, here's the thing. The first front just brings us wind. It's the second one that brings the big time chill in the air. Currently, let's focus in on the wind. Unfortunately, because of the state of the trees all across central Texas, it won't take much of a wind gust to cause more branches to come down. Wind advisory goes into effect tonight at six or at nine, I should say, and continues until noontime for most of our area. And at this point, my biggest concerns will be winds out of the southwest, 20 to 30 sustained. We may see some gusts up to as high as 40 plus miles per hour. Today, though, it hasn't been that windy at all. We've only seen gusts in the 20 mile per hour range. Actually, pretty nice overcast skies now, but but we saw a good amount of sunshine earlier. 68 degrees is our current temperature. We made it to a high that felt pretty nice, up to 71 degrees. Right now, as you can see, though, here we go. The moisture streaming in. And although it's showing up in the hill country on radar, it's actually evaporating before reaching the ground. So maybe a few sprinkles. But I do anticipate we will see a better rain chance, especially overnight, as this weather maker out west pulls through our area. That's cold front number one. It's a Pacific cold front. It's not packing any cold air whatsoever. So as we head toward Valentine's Day, temps will actually be warmer than today, but also quite windy. Currently at 67 in Granger, we're sitting at 69 in Bastrop, Blanca. Those of you down south are sitting at 66 degrees, and we do have some gusts. You can see San Marcos right now, 20 mile per hour wind gusting a little bit higher than that. But here's your forecast as we head through the overnight. I think that the heaviest, gustiest winds are going to hit right around 4 a.m. or so. Luckily, most of you will be sleeping, so you can sleep through the worst of the wind. At the bus stop tomorrow morning, southwest winds, lots of gusts, 20 to 30. 30 miles per hour and then we continue that as we head through your midday hours and then finally things start to settle down a little bit by late day. So your hour by hour wind gust forecast even in Austin we will see a sustained wind probably running about 20 miles per hour throughout the day. As far as temperatures are concerned, some early showers can't be ruled out. Then we hit a high temperature all the way up to 78 degrees with clouds giving way to sunshine. Some of you will also see some rain. I don't think it'll be much though. Latest computer model bringing that round in right around 60 to seven o'clock in the morning and then after that we've got the sunshine in place. By the way, if you want some big time warmth, I've got it for you. How about 80 degrees? That's crazy. Oh. We could hit 80 degrees as we head on into Wednesday and then the next cold front drops us into the 50s. <laughs> a little something a for everybody, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Chicago.